सी आई टी एन सी ई आर टी प्रेजेंट द ऑडियो बुक पूर्वी टेक्स्ट बुक ऑफ इंग्लिश फॉर ग्रेड सिक्स पेज नंबर ट्वेंटी यूनिट वन फेबल्स एंड फोक टेल्स चैप्टर थ्री राम टू द रेस्क्यू लेट एस डू दीज एक्टिविटीज बिफोर वी रीड वन आइडेंटिफाई द फॉलोइंग पीपल How do they help us when we are in trouble? There are three pictures shown here in this page. The first picture is that of a police woman. Second picture is that of a female doctor. Third picture is that of a female firefighter. Two. Choose the correct option to complete the sentence. The word rescue means to dash. A. Make fun of someone. B. Save someone. C. Ask someone for help. Three. Work in pairs. Put a tick mark at the end of the phrases describing those who need to be rescued. Share your answers with your teacher and classmates. A. A man stuck in a building on fire. B. A woman buying vegetables in the market. C. A dog. who has hurt its leg d a tree being cut down in a forest there are blank boxes in front of each sentence tick them page number 21 four the policeman in the story you are about to read is called the kotwal some people call him thanedar What do you call a policeman in your language? Share it with your classmates and teacher. 5. Imagine you are alone at home and you face a problem. Answer the following questions and share your answers with your teacher and classmates. A. Will you solve the problem yourself or wait for someone to help you? B. How will you deal with the problem? Give a reason. 1 be worried about the problem and give up 2 feel angry that only you have the problem 3 think quickly about ways to solve the problem let us read ram to the rescue a folk tale from tamil nadu script louis m fernandes illustrations ram vairkar in a village one night a husband and wife were about to sleep the husband says oh, oh what a hard day it has been i am feeling so sleepy what's the matter what are you looking at shh listen huh oh somebody is trying to get in i think He has already gotten. The noise has stopped. Lie down, lie down. Don't look, don't look. It's a thief. He must have somehow got past Ram. Ram was the village kothwal. Let us discuss. Circle the odd one. One. The characters are husband. wife children two who entered the house guest robber kothwal page number 22 there are three pictures shown in the bottom of page what should we do i'll i'll tell you listen meanwhile the thief peeped in and he said to himself voices they are awake i'll have to wait till they fall asleep i wonder where they keep their money huh page number 23 they are saying something perhaps they are talking about their money 
I would better listen closely. What should we name our child? If he is a boy, we'll call him Ram. Ram? <sighs> yes, that's a good name. When he's in the house, I'll call out softly to him. Ram! <laughs> Ram! Mm -hmm. Let us discuss, right, whether true or false. 1. The man tells his plan to his wife. 2. The thief wants to know where they kept their jewels. There are four pictures shown in the bottom of this page. The husband is talking to his wife. But what if he is in the yard? Then I'll call out a little louder. Ram! Ram! The thief talked to himself. I wish they would stop this silly game and talk about their money instead. Or fall asleep at least. On the other side, the husband was talking to his wife. But my dear, what if the boy is not in the house or in the yard, but in the street? Oh, then I'll call out very loudly. Ram! Ram! Page number 24. There are three pictures shown on the top of this page. In picture number one, the lady of the house is shown calling out for Ram loudly. In the second picture, Ram the Kotwal is seen outside the house and he hears that someone is calling him loudly. In the third picture, Ram the Kotwal is seen running towards the house where the noise is coming from. Let us discuss. 1. Along with your classmates, call out the name Ram softly, loudly and very loudly. 2. What do you think will happen next in the story? In the bottom of this page, four pictures are shown. In the first picture, Ram the Kotwal is shown running towards the house. Ram, the village Kotwal, ran to the house from which he heard his name being called. In the second picture, Ram the Kotwal is shown observing the broken wall of the house and he is talking to himself. Oh, oh, some thief has dug his way into this house. In the third picture, Ram the Kotwal is shown going inside the house through the broken wall. In the fourth picture, the thief is shown hiding behind a door and he is talking to himself. Oh, at last they have stopped their chatter. In this picture, Ram the Kotwal is shown noticing the thief behind the door. Page number 25 On the top of this page, four pictures have been shown. In the first picture, the thief is shown talking to himself. He says, Now soon they'll go to sleep and... In this picture, the hand of Ram the Kotwal is shown trying to grab the thief. In the second picture, Ram is shown arresting the thief. He says, You are under arrest. In the third picture, the husband and the wife are shown talking to each other with a smile on their face. The husband says, It's Ram. He heard us. <gasps> the plan worked. We are saved. In the fourth picture, Ram the Kotwal is shown taking the thief away. The man and his wife, by their cleverness, had saved themselves from being robbed. This story is taken from Amar Chitrakatha. Let us discuss. 1. 
work in pairs to match the words in column A with the meanings in column B. Check your answers by sharing them with your teacher and classmates. Column A 1. Wonder 2. Yard 3. Chatter 4. Instead 5. Closely 6. Perhaps Column B A. In place of someone or something B. Carefully C. An area outside a building D. Talk for a long time about unimportant things E. Maybe F. A feeling of surprise Page number 26 2. Fill in the boxes with suitable words as you read the story. Ram to the rescue. Main characters. Setting. Other characters. Problem. Solution. Let us think and reflect. 1. Read the following lines and then answer the questions that follow. A. Man. What's the matter? What are you looking at? Wife. Shh, listen. Man. Somebody is trying to get in. Wife. Uh, uh, I think he has gotten. The noise has stopped. One. What makes the man say the first line? Two. Choose the correct option. The wife says. Shh, listen. What does the word shh mean here? A. Sleep B. Help C. Rest D. Be silent 3. How can you tell that the wife was listening carefully? Page number 27 B. Ram, the village Kotwal, ran to the house from which he heard his name being called. Ram. Oh, oh, some thief has dug his way into this house. 1. Fill in the blank with the correct word from the given lines. The villagers caught the thief and took him to the fill in the blank. 2nd. 2. Choose the correct option. What do the words oh, oh show here? A. Surprise, B. Anger, C. Pain, D. Happiness. 3. How can you tell that the Kotwal was good at his job? 2. Give one reason why the man and his wife were not able to fall asleep. 3. What did the thief wish would happen? Did it happen? 4. How did the man and his wife get help from the Kotwal? 5. Do you think cleverness can help us solve our problems? Why do you say so? Let us learn. 1. Study the highlighted words in the following lines. I'm feeling so sleepy. The highlighted word is am. It's a thief. The highlighted word is it's. They're awake. The highlighted word is they are. The highlighted words given in the above sentences have one letter missing in each. What are they? Share them with your teacher and classmates. Now, write the full words with the missing letter. A. Dash. Feeling so sleepy. B. Dash. A thief. C. Dash. Awake. There is a box at the bottom of this page which describes the missing letters are marked by an apostrophe. Page number 28 2. Expand the following words. Two examples have been done for you. Use the contracted form of these words in sentences of your own. There is a box displayed on the top of this page with four headings. Serial number, contracted words, expanded form, sentences. A. Contracted words. 
what's expanded form what is b i'll c i would d we'll e that's f we are g don't h you'll i must have expanded form must have please fill in the blank spaces and make sentences 3 study the highlighted words and the words in the brackets in the following sentences from the story a i'm feeling so sleepy am plus feel plus ing b what are you looking at r plus look plus ing c somebody is trying to get in is plus try plus ing d they are saying something r plus say plus ing e perhaps they are talking about their money r plus talk plus ing now choose the correct option the sentences a to e refer to actions that dash are going on the time of speaking or happened in the past or will take place in the future page number 29 verbs that describe what someone or something is doing at the moment of speaking are in the present progressive tense number 4 fill in the blanks to complete the following sentences a i dash in grade 6 am plus study plus ing b my friend dash a story book is plus read plus ing c we dash a board game r plus play plus ing d fill in the blank a new language am plus learn plus ing e the teachers dash in the staff room r plus sit plus ing f my mother dash food in the kitchen is plus cook plus ing 5 study the picture and fill in the blanks with the present progressive form of verbs this is a picture of a park a mother is sitting on a bench and reading a book her children govind and anu are playing with football along with their dog pema is trying to pluck some flowers from the garden anil is keeping a score sitting on a wheelchair The scoreboard reads Govind 2 goals, Anu 3 goals. There's some food, water and fruits lying on a sheet which is spread on the grass. There are some birds flying in the background. Page number 30. A. Govind and Anu dash football. B. Pema dash flowers. C Anil dash the score card D the mother dash a book E the dog dash to catch the ball F the birds dash in the sky 6 study the following sentences from the story and complete the table one example has been done for you A I would better listen closely B When he is in the house I'll call out softly to him C then I'll call out very loudly A table is shown with four columns and four headings serial number sentence question and word serial number 1 I'd better listen closely How does he listen A closely Two, when he is in the house, I'll call out softly to him. How does she call out? B, fill in the blank.
थ्री देन आल कॉल आउट वेरी लाउडली हाउ डज शी कॉल आउट सी फिल इन द ब्लैंक वर्ड्स दैट गिव मोर इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट द वर्ब सच एज हाउ वेन वेयर एक्सेट्रा आर कॉल्ड एडवर्ब्स सेवन फिल इन द ब्लैंक्स विद सूटेबल एडवर्ब्स फ्रॉम द बॉक्स देर आर टू एक्स्ट्रा वर्ड्स दैट यू डू नॉट नीड warmly gracefully smoothly beautifully funnily quickly hurriedly page number 31 a he solved the mathematics problem dash b the car moved dash along the highway c the musician played the guitar dash D Shobha danced dash E Rohit left the house dash 8 fill in the blanks with suitable adverbs from the box there are two extra words that you do not need honestly brightly peacefully sweetly angrily slowly tirelessly once upon a time in a small forest animals lived one dash the wise old tortoise moved two dash but always won the race against the proud rabbit the ants worked three dash gathering food for the winter the kind hearted lion ruled the jungle four dash giving everyone a chance to speak the birds sang five dash making everyone in the forest happy 9 study the following sentences from the story and choose the correct option 1 oh hmm what a hard day it has been 2 ah at last they've stopped their chatter 3 what should we do 4 what should we name our child a sentence 1 expresses a feeling of dash tiredness or joy b sentence 2 expresses a feeling of dash wonder or relief c sentence 3 and 4 ask dash answers or questions page number 32 10 punctuate the following sentences and write whether they are exclamatory or interrogative sentences a wow what an intelligent man he is b oh how big the hole is c do you like to read comic books d what is your favorite story sentences that express a strong feeling are called exclamatory sentences they are marked by an exclamation mark sentences that ask questions are called interrogative sentences they are marked by a question mark let us listen you will listen to a security guard making an announcement to the people in the neighborhood as you listen fill in the blanks with only one word that you hear refer to page number 38 for transcript the security guard announced that one dash has been happening in that area he advised everyone to stay safe and the kids to tell the two dash as soon as they find anything different they should not forget that three dash is the main thing he asked them to call four dash when they need immediate help let us speak One, listen to your teacher pronounce the contractions and repeat after your teacher. I'll, it's, don't, am, I'd, he's, that's, will, they are, you are, we are, what's. We use contracted form of the verbs while speaking. an expanded form of the verbs while writing page number 
Now speak these contractions clearly along with your teacher and classmates. Can't, won't, I've, wouldn't, shouldn't, didn't. 2. Discuss in pairs. A. Why do you think it's important for people to keep their house and themselves safe? Tick the suitable reasons. 1. To be safe from injury. 2. To keep family members and pets safe. 3. To stop accidents from happening. 4. To make sure they visit the doctor regularly. 5. To stop robbery. 6. To pay the electricity bill. 7. To save money. Put a tick mark in the empty boxes given after the sentences. B. Now, use the given hints to share your reasons in complete sentences with your teacher and classmates. I think it's important because... Dash, slash, I feel it's necessary as... Dash, slash. The reason we need to look at safety is... Dash. C. Use the given hints to share three ideas on how people can keep their houses and themselves safe. Share with your classmates and teachers. I think they should... Dash, slash. I suppose they could... Dash, slash. They must... Dash, slash. They should, dash, slash. How about, dash, slash. It might be better to, dash. Page number 34. Let us write. The next day, the neighbor asked the man in the story about what had happened. Ask the man, tell the neighbor what had happened in your own words. Remember to include the following when, dash, where, dash, what, dash, how, dash, why, dash. You may begin this way. My wife and I were about to go to sleep last night when we heard someone. Let us explore. 1. Find out from your teacher or parents what you would do in the following situations. Who will you call if you see fire, you see someone getting hurt, you see a wounded animal, you see someone suspicious, you find a lost child, you get lost. Page number 35 2. Find the right path for the Kotwal to catch the thief. On this page, a Kotwal is shown chasing a thief. And there is a pathway. You have to find the pathway. Page number 36 Transcripts Let us listen. Refer to page 10. A bottle of dew. Madhumati is very happy as she has many big bags of bananas. Firstly, she visits her mother and gives her two dozen bananas. Secondly, she goes to the market to sell the bananas. Next, she meets her old friend Kalavati in the market. Then, she gifts Kalavati a dozen bananas. Later, she decides to go home and she has sold most of the bananas. After that, on the way home, she meets a little boy who's hungry and gives him two bananas. Lastly, she goes to her neighbor's house and gives them a bunch of bananas. She has a smile on her face as she goes home. You will listen to the audio or narration once again. As you listen, check your answers. Page number 37 Transcripts Let us listen. Refer to page number 18. The Raven and the Fox Dear students, the crow felt really sad because the fox cheated him. In the quiet night, the crow thought and said to himself, I was fooled by kind words, but I have learnt 
something important. Even if I don't have beautiful feathers, I'm smart. To share his wisdom, he decided to go on a journey. He wanted to tell all the other animals to be careful with words. He told them, do not let pride lose what you have. You will listen to the audio or narration once again. As you listen, check your answers. Page number 38 Transcripts Let us listen. Refer to page 32. Ram to the rescue. Attention all! There are reports of robbery in our locality. Please be alert and listen to the instructions carefully. Lock all doors and windows at night and also when you leave the house. Children, you must inform any suspicious activity to adults immediately. Do not talk with strangers or get anything from them. Report anything unusual. Always remember that safety is important. Dial 100 in case of emergency. You will listen to the audio or narration once again. As you listen, check your answer. Purvi, you were just listening to this audiobook. Textbook of English for grade 6. Narration, Babla Kocher and Richa Sayal. Technical coordination, Bati Langlingdo. Sound recordist, Manju Kumari. Assistance in production, Soumya Malik. Directed and produced by Vimalesh Choudhury. This audiobook is presented to you by CIET NCERT, New Delhi, India.